y'all this is Shonda and today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys some eyelashes as you can see I got one from elevatestyles.com and the kind of eye, uh, eyelashes that I'm going to be showing you guys are coming from a company called Glam Eye um, this is one of the packages that I received so I hope you see it um, these are Glam 76, and the ones that I'm showing you guys are Glam 47. Now, sorry my nails are dirty, but these are 100% human Remy hair eyelashes. I know, right? Step up the game with the lashes. It says that they last up to four weeks, and they're suitable for contact lens wearers. So, you pretty much, um treat them like you would any normal lashes. Um, what I did on this eye is I trimmed it to fit my eye, which I could have probably trimmed it a little bit more, but honestly, I think it fits really well. They're just really dramatic. Let's see if you guys can see. <laughs> I mean, I really like them. I love the fact that they're really dramatic. They're not like overpowering dramatic. So, how I normally do my lashes is I got my little tweezers right here and then I just pretty much lift them off of the card like that I I kinda already know where I want to trim them to if I can find my little trimmer okay I use my and I already got the other one still stuck on here but I use my little trimmers here and I go from the outer corner and I just snip it a little bit. Snip it right off. I pretty much know the length of my eye. Um, how I do it, you guys may think it's unsanitary, but I have a pad here, or a little napkin here with um, alcohol on it, and I use the end of my brush. It's just a lot easier for me to apply the glue to it. So I wipe the um, ends of the brush on that pad and I'm using some black eyeliner glue and I'll just dip it in and get it on the end and just brush it across the end you can use a q-tip you can use um, toothpick whatever you want I don't put a lot on mine only because I would like to take mine off at the end of the night so I don't put a lot of them on. So I'm just going to wave it. I try to do it until I see the glue actually turning darker, the darker black. I do it for maybe like 30 seconds, 20, 30 seconds, just so I can get a little bit tacky. And then I take it and put it on my lash. My problem area getting it to stick is always in the inner corner. So then I take my tweezers and I kind of just press it down. And then what I also do, which I don't know if I'm the only person that ever does this, but I try to press it down and try to push it as far or as close to my lash line as I can. And then we have it. So that's how I put on my lashes, but I don't know. It, they do feel a little bit different. They feel they feel softer. 
The lashes that I've been using a lot lately are from the Kiss brand, um, the I Envy lashes. But these just feel softer for some strange reason. And like I said, they're highly dramatic. But I've had lashes that has been highly dramatic and they just look uber fake. And, you know, we know that they're fake lashes, but they don't need to look like it. So here are my lashes. I'm using a different camera today, so I'm hoping that you guys can hear me. I'm hoping that you can see me, and I'm hoping that the quality of it is very good. But they're my lashes. I really like these lashes. I mean, like I said, they're dramatic, but they're not like, you know, unbearable. They don't make my eyes look heavy. So if you guys are interested in these lashes, you can get them from ElevateStyles.com. I'll put the link in the side or in the information box below. Still rocking my sew in. I'm actually about to curl it, and um, I'm gonna film me curling it. But I cut it, I, I layered it a bit, and I, I didn't do it on camera. It was so spur of the moment I was about to go to work, and I tried curling it on Mother's Day, but it just didn't turn out right because it was all one length, and it just didn't look right to me. So I uh, layered it yesterday before I went to work, and um, so now I'm gonna go ahead and uh, curl it. So. I can look decent. <laughs> but again, elevatestyles.com. They're called Glam Eye. The ones that I have on are Glam Eye 47. I also have a pair that's Glam. I'm sorry, Glam 47. These are Glam 76. And I'll probably come back and show you guys these a different day. And then they also make individuals. And they say that they're not free. The ones that I have are natural, short, and they're black. It's 70 Remy Hair Individual Eyelashes in this package right here. I'm not good at putting on individuals. I will probably look at about 80 tutorials before I attempt to do these. I, I used to do, when I first started wearing lashes, I used to do these all the time and it, they were okay, but as I got older and lazier, <laughs> I started doing the uh, strips, and they're just so much easier and quicker, of course. But um, I'm going to try to do these, if not on myself. It, I think these are a little bit easier to do on someone else than on myself. I don't know why. But I really, I'm feeling these uh, glam eye, natural rim and hair lashes. So head on over to Elevate Styles if you guys are interested in copying your pair or two of these lashes. I will put pictures up at the blog after I do my hair and um, you guys can kind of get a up close and in depth look uh, at the lashes. So if you got any questions hit me up and I'm going to holler at you guys later.